All right, let's start Stellarium. And there we are. I have it set right now for uh, where I am, just north of Detroit in southeast Michigan. And uh, as I'm doing this, it's about uh, just before 9 o'clock at night. So everything looks fine for me here, and I've got my location set. I'm going to put the double arrows, push the double arrows back here to go back to about maybe um, yeah, about 7 o'clock. And yeah, that's when the sun sets around here. But let's say that I want to move to another location. Let's say I'm going to Madaba in Jordan. And I will go there and at... Oh, that's not right, because the time zone isn't working right. Look at this. I have it here. If you look down here, it's... What is it, about 2.45 in the afternoon and it's dark. Well, that's not right. Let's change the time zone here. In the configuration window, you can either press F2 or just move your cursor off to the left here. Uh, you'll see this uh, dialog come up. One of the tabs says plugins. Let's go down to the bottom here where it says time zone. All this other stuff you can add to Stellarium. But I'm going to pick time zone and configure it. And of course, we all know that the time zone in Madaba, Jordan is universal time plus three hours offset from UTC. Okay, that's set at three hours. I save the settings, close that, close that, and hit control Q to close Celest or Stellarium because I need to restart Stellarium. Next time I start Stellarium, it should be all set. Oops, it defaults to my location here again. I am going to once again search for Madaba. There it is. Oh, I'm going to use this. If I were there in Jordan, I would click this use as default. So every time I start Stellarium, it would go here. Let's see if this looks right. Let me move the time back to about, what? About 18 hours and, oh good, the time zone works. So we're all set. Just remember to restart Celestia. Choose your location and click that little use as default location so that every time you start it up, it's all set. If you want to go someplace else on Earth to another location, and if you want the time to be correct, you need to reconfigure that time zone plugin once again. And there you go. That's how you do it.